Hello, all you vapers and vape bets. Yet again, it is I, Harmony. And Brandon. And welcome to another segment of Two Different Vapors. Sorry, I messed up my intro, though. Whatever. Y'all aren't here for the intro. You're here for the juice. Speaking of juice, we have been gone for a while because we haven't really had any to review. But now we do, so we are back. Hello. Oh, with an exception of a few. Yeah, we have a few more to review from Vapor Slam, but we just... I've just been really busy doing job stuff. Yeah. <laughs> Being an adult <laughs> sucks. Anyway. <laughs> um, so... A uh, company emailed us, and it's very strange when people contact us because, you know, we're not Grim Green or anything. We're not the <laughs> most popular YouTube people. Yeah, not So really. it's very rare when we get an email like so this. So we got excited. And so they said the that they wanted from... us to review their juice. And the company is called Volcano E-Cigs, which I think is awesome. An eruption of flavors. <laughs> but yeah. And they just came out with the, what is it called? What is it called? Oh, wow. Lava line. Makes sense because volcanoes and lava. Huh? 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 I see what they did there. But, um. Each of these different flavors is based off a different volcano, like Mount Vesuvius, which is a flavor, Fuji, which is a flavor, and, you know, other volcanoes, popular volcanoes. Yeah, I was looking at the email, and they have some stuff that they would like for us to tell you, and we will do all that at the end of the video. It's about the the website and all that stuff so yeah so for now let's just get into the juice it's a 50 50 blend and they are amazing okay you wouldn't really expect much well okay let me rephrase this i've been vaping a lot of max vg for a good let's say seven or eight months to yeah, a year max vg and you don't really expect much when you hit back to 50 50 blends like when you think of 50 50 you think oh that's starter kit blend that's for you know the casual vapor and i'm a really big cloud chaser so that's what i'm always going for you know bigger clouds Ooh, but bigger clouds i mean it's you wouldn't expect this much flavor and this well crafted juice line to become from a 50 50 blend it's it's a good juice line yeah all right, so the first flavor that we have to try. This is what the bottle looks like. They sent us a little bottle and three big bottles. This is the little bottle. That's what it looks like. Pretty cool, right? Pretty classy. The thing that I love about this line is that the presentation is so, like, it's sleek. It's like city. It's, it's nice. Let me see what this one's called. This one is called Diamond Head. This is based off Diamond Head Mountain or Volcano Aware Harmony. I cannot recall. It doth not say. Okay, well... But we do have the flavor profile. A tropical mix of tangy passion fruit, sugared orange, and sweet guava nectar, this signature Hawaiian citrus blend engages your senses with a powerful flavor profile. So okay, you know I what? I drip it. I want to try it. Let's do this. Yeah, yeah. By the way, they sent us this really cool gear to wear for this review. They oh, sent yeah. Me a Volcano e -cig shirt with their logo and these cool little Volcano e -cig sunglasses. Let's see if you can see that. And this is my shirt. And I freaking love it because it says the Volcano Vapors Association. And of then America. I, of America. Because America. And then at the bottom it says, I'll give you my e -cig when you pry it from my cold dead hands. Which is true. Because it's mine. Cannot have it. So while Brandon's dripping that, I wanted to say hi, you guys. We missed you guys. How have you been? What you been doing? Found any new juice that you like? What's going on? Let us know in the comments. Thank you to all our subscribers. Yes. For mm. watching our videos. Thank you to everybody who comments. Probably shocked to everyone when they like log on to YouTube and they're like, oh, they have a new video up. What? <laughs> so, <laughs> all right. So let's give this a try. Definitely taste the guava, and I like the orange flavor too. It's more. Like I could taste the guava. I, it's it's a really like tropical fruity flavor. It's like all the mixture, all the mm -hmm. different things, and the cloud. Did you see the cloud? That's from a fifty fifty blend. Yeah, I think. That's and it, a really it's good smooth. It it's not hot or cold. It's just like pure flavor. And there's a little bit, not too much, but like there's a little bit of hit in the back so you can be like, yeah, that's vaping. And that's, I like it. It's a good flavor. Um, I taste a lot of the orange in it. I taste a really good nectary guava flavor and all around, I think that's an A plus for me. Yeah, it's an A plus. I taste more guava. Like on the inhale, I taste a little bit of the orange and the citrus, but on the exhale, it's like straight guava. I love that word, guava. 
It's a really good citrus flavor. Yeah, yeah. All right, that's going to be gone within 15 minutes after we <laughs> stop the video. This is mine. All, All right. right. The next one we are going to try is Grimm's... Uh, I cannot pronounce this, but it's... Grimm's a, Botten, I think? Yes, it's um, a volcano, and it says Southeast Iceland. All right, let me break down these boxes for you. Okay, so this is what they come packaged in. Packaged in this neat little box, right? On the side, it tells you about how it's mixology mastered, crafted, everything. It tells you, you know, the warning label, not for pregnant people, blah, 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 blah. And it tells you the flavor profile on the back, or on the other side of it. And it tells you that. But this is the cool part. You pull the box out. This is the outer box. Outer box. Outer box. This is the inner box. Now on the side of it, it tells you the coordinates of the volcano. Which where, I think is awesome. Where it's located. It tells you the elevation of it. And it also tells you on the back its last eruption when it was when it last erupted, which is pretty cool. When did that one last erupt? 2011. Ooh, volcanoes. Are then stirring. you pull it out, and you get this other. This is the inner inner box. Inner type. inner box. But it tells you. Let's see. It tells, it tells you, you all about like all of the different ones. All, all the different them. flavors and all the different flavor profiles for each one of them, which is also really cool. Just in this line, they also have more juices that I actually kind of want to try on their website and everything. But this is just one line. This is what you get from one line. This is their premium line. Then you pull it out. And there you go. Your bottle is revealed. And I love how they're all co color coordinated. Like uh, they all are the same color, they have the same designs, and it's like, it's, it's classy looking. It, and it's it awesome. makes you feel like being elite. Yeah, it makes you feel like, well, I'm fancy. Like, mm. yeah, that's what I get for vaping, you know, I get cool stuff. I get cool boxes. What do you get, cigarette smokers? <laughs> you get a lame box. Cancers um, and loogies? What? Cancers and loogies, what in the world? <laughs> but, <laughs> and there's the bottle, and we're going to go ahead and give Let this Let me read one. you the flavor profile of this, because right. I'm excited about this. Go for that. Indulge in an arctic burst of flavor. Cool and refreshing bramble berry skyer Icelandic yogurt opens up the flavors, perfectly matched by a touch of smooth vanilla and mint aftertaste notes. Now, let me tell you, when I heard mint, I was thinking strong menthol, right? Like this thing is going to hit us. And then like gonna I'm going to feel like I just drank a gallon of mouthwash is what I was thinking because that's what you usually get from most menthol flavors. By the way, we got a new filming futon. Oh, yeah. Filming you that futon. little fat. Yeah, so that's that sound the is, is the futon. It's really nice looking too. Yeah, yeah, I like my futon. But yeah, I was thinking that it was going to be like heavy menthol, right? Watch this. 70 watts, okay? I don't even know what my coil is built at. Point one. Point one coil at 70 watts. It is so smooth. It is so freaking smooth. I can't... And the menthol does not overpower it whatsoever. It doesn't. You can taste it. When they say light mint, they really mean light mint. It's like you're chewing a... Oh. They have this grape gum that has a mint aftertaste. And that's, that's kind of what it tastes like, only it's not great. Just the mint aftertaste, I mean. Like, it leaves your mouth cool, and it kind of opens you up a little bit, and you can taste every little thing that is in it. So, way to go, Iceland. <laughs> it tastes like Iceland. It tastes like you're eating cold yogurt out in the freezing it cold. Is, it's so good. <laughs> like, I was, I was just sitting there after I tried it for the first time. I was just going, how? How is it so good? But it's a really good flavor. You really it's get amazing. the berry taste to it. I don't know if you get a yogurt taste to it. I get berry, vanilla, and a hint of menthol. That's what I get from it. That's exactly what it says, and it's really I get good. a little bit of yogurt on the exhale just because it's so creamy. But it's not like you're just eating a cup of yogurt. That's not what it is at all. It's just, it's so creamy it's a and creamy so smooth. Yeah, like she said. All right, I get the yogurt now. It's like a really creamy flavor. Yeah. It's, I love it so much. Like, this is all day vape. Yes. Just, yes. But that flavor gets another A plus from the line. Yeah, yeah. All right. What's the next one you want to do? Let's save that one for last. Let's do Fuji. All right. Mount Fuji. Again. Fuji. This one is located on, let's see, Honshu, Japan. Or Japan. Wow, I said it like a Japanese man. <laughs> Honshu, Japan. <laughs> 
Miranda, you open it up. Stop! We might have Japanese viewers. It tells you it's last eruption. Konnichiwa. Now, when this was last erupted, it was 1707 through 1708. So it was a pretty big eruption that happened there. Let me go ahead and get rid of this notification on my phone. Boop. Thank you for alerting me. I had 20% battery. The struggles of iPhone. And it tells you the coordinates, elevation, all that good stuff. Now let's open this one up. Same as the others. It has the cool little thingy dingy that I love. I love this thingy dingy. The thingy make dingy. The thingy make dingy. A thingy dingy. And this is in South. No, that's the wrong one. A der. Wrong box for the wrong thing in the popper. Whatever, just vape the juice. Yeah. Vape the juice. We'll just organize vape later. Vape it. Alright. Vape it. Vape it. Vape it. Go ahead, drip it. Yeah, I'm gonna drip it. I got my cotton dry with the last one. I'm not wasting any of that juice. Ugh. And let me tell you, the smells of these of this juice, like all of them, they they taste how they smell, and they smell so good. Uh, I agree with that. Like I would wear this crap as perfume if I could. I'm not saying crap because it's bad; it's just junk. Because I didn't want to say anything else. Darn it! Except my speech pattern. Uh, I don't know. I haven't seen you guys in a while, so I'm I'm hyper. I'm excited. <laughs> What's the flavor profile in this one? Delicious. <laughs> <No>. <laughs> okay. Flavor profile for this one. This masterful blend starts with mandarin oranges. Yes, on the inhale. Then is tempered on the palate with sweet hibiscus and a touch of crisp cherry blossom. Now, if you guys have been watching us for a while, you know that we've had some hibiscus juice before. And we were not fans of it at all. It was too flowery. It was... It just wasn't our thing. But this... The orange mixed in so light or nicely with the flowery taste, it really gives you a Japanese feel to it. It's a really good. It's like it's so good. It's like eating what you're vaping. It's really good. It I'm is. not gonna lie. This is a really good flavor. In like my it's opinion. like sugary oranges on the inhale, and then on the exhale, you just taste a really sweet, like light hint of hibiscus. It's really sweet, and you get all of that tangy goodness that you get from like sucking an orange. Not that I suck oranges, but it, that's what I assume it would be like. <laughs> and it's just, oh, it's so good. I can't. It tastes like freshly squeezed orange juice. Oh, it does. It's just, oh, I love it. I love it so much. Ah. But this line so far is 100% out of me so far. It's 100%. Now, we don't get paid for this stuff at all. <laughs> I wish we did that. That'd be cool. <laughs> yeah, I wish we did too, but we don't get paid at all. Everything that we say is our opinion solely. You're able to take it how, or how you want to. But in our opinion, both so far, this line is a go-getter. It's it's up there. The presentation alone, I was like, oh, well, that's, that's, that's nice. And then you smell the juice, and it's like, that's even better. And then you taste the juice, and then your brain just explodes, because it's like... Pfft. It's great presentation... And the company's really Outstanding friendly. The guy that was, uh, or Scott guy from day. Volcano. Yeah. Scott, there we go. That's his name. But uh, the guy that was uh, emailing us, he was really polite, really friendly, really enthusiastic about wanting us to do this review. So shout out to you, sir, because you are cool. Thank you, Scott. Yes. All right. So the next flavor that we have here is my personal favorite of the line. <laughs> this is Vesuvius. Now Ooh. this is located in Naples, Italy. Tells you all the coordinates, and its last eruption was, if I remember correctly, without looking on the box, 1942. Really? Let me see. Ah, 1944. Well, that one's a brewing. Mm. Two years off. But we'll go ahead and give this one a shot. The flavor profile for it is... Experience is sweet and decadent Italian biscotti dipped in rich white chocolate. I love biscotti. Hazelnut notes open up a full-bodied flavor with touches of dried cherry on the finish. And this is my personal favorite of the line. This is a complete go-getter. Now, I've had a lot of chocolate vapes in the past, and chocolate doesn't really sit well in the vaping world it most doesn't. of the time. But for once, one company actually got it right. They did it perfectly. It tastes like a white chocolate brownie with a little bit of cherry in it to me. Before I had this juice, honestly, I'd been tired of vaping for a while because everything was starting to taste the same and 
I don't know. It was just really uh, it was starting to get dull. But this, this has so gotten me excited about vaping again. All the flavors and the cloud production and just this is really good. Like that's my top flavor. This whole line is 100 percent through and through. Let's go get her. Let me try it. The flavor, it, the chocolate it. in it. It's not strong, oh, but it's like on. biting into a fresh biscotti with white chocolate on it. I love biscotti. You I don't really. In the coffee. I don't get too much flavor, but I get a little bit, or just enough to be like, okay, that's a little bit of cherry in there. But it's yeah, 100. percent This it, is the okay, best like chocolate flavor. The biscotti. Flavor. It's if, for those of you that don't know what biscotti, it's like a cookie that you put in like your coffee, and it's really crisp, and that's kind of what this is. It tastes like just like a really cool graham cracker to start off with. But with the white chocolate on top, it's got a brownie flavoring to it. A little bit that. of white chocolate. You taste that on the exhale. And it's so smooth. <laughs> All of this is so smooth. And uh, you taste that on the exhale. And then you get a little bit of an aftertaste of like the dried cherries. And I don't even like cherries. Okay, I'm, I'm not going to lie. I hate cherries. I do, but this is good. <laughs> this is a perfect juice. Mixed I with the chocolate, it's it does not bother me at all. It's, it's awesome. <laughs> this one is my all-day vape. All-day vape through and through. So, yeah, you guys should go check it out. Look at what they have. And their website's really cool, too. It's really organized and really clean. It's really easy to navigate. <coughs> now, to purchase, to purchase these liquids, you got to go to www.volcanoe6.com. And we will put a link in the description. And you can get the twenty or the full line 20% off if you buy the entire line. Or there are discounts available per flavor if you buy in increments of 3, 5, or 10 bottles. So if you buy three of these bottles, there's discounts. There's, I mean, they're really good with that. But a 20% discount off the full line, I say do it. If you're a flavor junkie, just most definitely go for this line. Shia LaBeouf it. Just do it. Don't let your dreams be dreams, because yesterday you said tomorrow. So just do it. <laughs> I love Shia Nothing LaBeouf. is impossible. <laughs> Don't start the speech. He's been reciting Shia LaBeouf nonstop. I could do it perfectly. He can, and it's disturbing. <laughs> but yeah, you guys should go and check it out and like this video and subscribe wherever the subscribe button is because YouTube changes constantly. And I don't know, say hi to us. We have an email and like comment and stuff because we like talking to you guys because the few subscribers that we have we want to stay in contact with and be friendly. Yeah. Yeah. All right. Thank you to Scott. From Volcano e Sigs for sending us out the t-shirts, the sunglasses. And most definitely the juice. <laughs> and your amazing juice line. Uh, yeah, you guys are awesome, seriously. Thank you guys so much for watching. I suggest you 100% go out and grab this line. Yeah. There's a discount for it, too, so I say just buy the whole thing. There's only four <laughs> There's only four flavors, so buy the whole thing. 20% off, that's not bad. It, it's really not. It's awesome, and I love it. I'm just, I'm just so excited. <laughs> but, again, thank you guys for watching, and we hope you have a... Good day. Have a good day or night or evening wherever you are. Yeah. Bye you guys. Bye. Peace.